Why do you gotta do that? Well, look what you did to the garage. Look what they did to the door. They ripped all out. Yeah. They're ripping it all out. I'm trying to get in there. Wanna go see the Jeep? No, you can't. Got work to do. Stop ripping the weather stripping off the garage. Alright, so today <clears throat> I'm gonna plan on making a thing for my switches. Here is the ashtray from the Jeep. And I'm gonna need switches for my fog lights and my off-road lights. I got five switches here. I've got voltage, I've got USB, and I've got a regular 12 volt plug. But I doubt it. I'm not gonna fit all these in here. These are just the tools that I have. But I do want to get switch, a couple switches. I'd like to get a voltmeter in there and possibly USB. So I traced out this little template for now. And this is just a piece of plastic from an old computer. And rigid stuff. So I know you could use metal, but plastic would be easy to drill. So I'm going to use this. this template and I'm just gonna put these on here like this and my plant steals stop stealing my parts so I have to go up and try to design this and it steals it and keeps stealing my parts. Alright here we are coming along switches are gonna go right here got four of them and then the two All right, so I'm outside now. I'm gonna run the wires. Don't mind the sirens. It's Christmas time and they got Santa on the, the fire truck driving around all around town. Um, I'm gonna go right there. See what that X mark X is? X marks the spot. That I'm gonna drill. I just drill the pilot hole and then I'm gonna use this half inch grommet. I'm gonna put a half inch bit on it now. And that basically comes right down underneath you can see the lights coming through right there. Um, that's like a plug that I, looks like you can actually knock that plug out. I've seen people do it as well. But I'm just doing that way, putting a grommet there. And this way I could feed more wires in at a later time. But that's where I'm getting the wires through the fire hole. Firewall, fire hole, what the hell am I thinking? Let's see if we get, there you go. The grommet's in. And I'm just going to run the wires through and then I'll put a little bead of silicone, but at least the grommet's there to protect the wires. Alright, so I got everything wired there. It's going through the grommet. Comes up. I got everything zip tied. Coming around here. Here, this is going to be the relay for the lights and into the lights here. It's freaking freezing. And then just have a little fuse box here. This is going to the switches inside. And then this one is going to go. switch panel it's all up and if switches aren't doing anything right now except this switch this switch will control the voltage there you go 12.2 and that'll also control the USB all right so it came out good I ran the wires sneak them through here they come out up and under and then out that firewall there actually I can get rid of that now this will plug into here. 
still looks pretty good. This little plate came out okay. It's not perfect, but not bad for cutting with a uh, a Dremel. All right, the lights are in. Oh, I feel like every time I film, I'm talking about how cold it is. But I had to cut here and here to put those lights in because they wouldn't fit in the stock uh, fog light position, which is alright, because I'm eventually going to take these off anyway when I get a new front bumper. Um, in fact, I might just take those off, just because they're ugly, and I see a lot of people take them off. I'm going to take off my, my mud flaps. But anyway, the uh, switches work, the relays work. You know, as I said, that controls the USB and my voltage. This controls the lights. And they are. I'm just gonna have to adjust them at night to see uh, which way they're shining. All right, so here's regular headlights. And then here are the LEDs. <laughs> Excuse my garbage over there. Wednesday's recycles. So, big difference. Headlights, and then that's with the LEDs. And it's without the headlights. Wow, huge difference. But quick, easy install coming through that firewall. Um, and going through the switch, I really love this switch panel. It's going to make it great for when I add future things. Much easier. Um, everything's already wired. I just have to run the primary um, to it, to whatever else I decide to add. But, uh, that's it. I'll put up some links in the description. And, um, you know, the relays and all that other stuff and information. In case, in case you don't know how to wire relays. Alright, thanks for tuning in. I'm going inside warm up later. Stop fighting, you two. Trying to work. <laughs> Oh boy, quit it. Get him, Chevy. Go get him. Good job.